We're here at CBS 2016 in Nairobi, Kenya, and I'm very pleased to be joined this morning by Ms. Ilana Milkes, who is founder and CEO of World Tech Makers. Ilana, thank you very much for being in the studio with us this morning. No, thank you for having me. Now, you're here representing a, uh, a new generation of uh, innovators, and you're going to be t taking part in a panel session this afternoon uh, of innovation, uh, which is essentially helping the socioeconomic development, obviously in a technological kind. And uh, I wanted to ask you a little bit about uh, World Tech Makers and, uh, and what's, what's your innovation. Okay, great. Thank you. So, um, World Tech Makers is a technology education startup. Um, and uh, we're focused in unleashing human potential in emerging markets. Um, so we pioneer on-site coding boot camps, which is a new type of very practical training focused on developing software and hardware skills um, in very short amount of time. Um, and we have also evolved um, by creating other apps. Uh, so there's one called Bootcamps Online to have those bootcamps online and live. Um, another app called Go Nativo, focused on empowering children with the 21st century skills, which are programming skills, um, and a job matching app um, to match demand with uh, what the talent um, that is available. So, now, yeah. you're based in Colombia. Have you started this off there? Uh, are there any particular challenges uh, uh, locally for you and, and, and globally yes. as well? Yes, yeah, so um, we started um, in Colombia, um, and uh, we have been able to scale to other countries like Brazil and Chile. Um, and uh, we are looking at Mexico as well. There have been, of course, a lot of challenges. Um, the um, IT industry is very, uh, you know, male dominated. Um, so as a young woman, you have those challenges, plus, you know, being in a context of emerging markets. Uh, but we have had, you know, good results and a uh, great team. Um, so I think that helps a lot for sure, yeah. How many people do, have you managed to uh, gather around you to, to bring this idea to fruition? We have 16 people um, in different places. Um, that's our core team right now. Yeah. And they're all working remotely? And a lot of working remotely, yes. <laughs> yeah, from okay. different places. Um, this is a very new trend, but um, it helps a lot in terms of the dynamic of, of the team. It's very agile, focused on you know, very short sprints of work and iterations, like software development. Um, so we're very, you know, also like virtual in that sense, yeah. And what's your timeline for world domination then? <laughs> well, one of our goals is to really make emerging markets um, a very important center of technology development. One of the main problems that uh, we have seen is that um, talent is universal, but opportunities are not. Um, so just one fact, for instance, um, digital natives, which are the children who can work with like, you know, devices from very early ages. Um, one out of 10 are digital natives in emerging markets versus eight out of 10 in, de in developed markets. Um, and you think about, if you think about the context and the implications of this, um, we're gonna continue in a position where our talent will not get full capacity um, so we're really pushing and trying to make programming, you know, part of the national curriculum, uh, create apps where all children or teenager, teenagers and young adults will be able to, to, you know, reach their capacity and build software on their own. Um, so beyond, you know, having a metric of, hey, you know, we're going to get to, I don't know, 2 million users, um, our, really, our goal is to have the entire region, you know, create awareness about this. Um, and hopefully you reach you know, a level where a lot of South American countries will get to that point of empowering you through coding skills. So that's kind of our, our goal right now, yeah. I understand at the end of this session they'll be voting for the, the best innovation. Yeah. Uh, we do, we do, obviously at this stage <laughs> we don't know who that's going to be, but yeah, we, I wish you the very best of luck with that. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Thank you.